if you disagree, but I think Fox wins this. Fox wins the matchup, but it's very, very volatile. Mm -hmm. I can uh, sense that. I, if, Fal if Fox gets off stage, it's the, like, the easiest stock for Falco to take. Mm -hmm. Because um, Falco's um, fair seems to be a little bit more efficient at getting that sometimes than Fox's. For does. sure, it's disjointed actually. And if you get um, the last of it, you can get that semi spike, which is pretty cool. Yep. Which we're seeing really aggro play early on by both people. Daybreak instantly taking stage control, and uh, that was really unfortunate because the laser hit him as he was doing that. He didn't have enough frames to be able to regrab the ledge. Mm -hmm. I'm surprised Daybreak is uh, staying on stage as much as he is. Usually he's more proactive with the forward airs. Mm -hmm. I think he's kind of respecting. Oh, that's going to take it, yeah. That's a fresh bear, too. Yep. The fresh moves have that 5% um, freshness bonus, correct, in this game? I believe so, yeah. They weren't using the last time. In that fair, a lot of people will drop shield to that. Ooh. Fair. Good up smash, though. Is a forward tilt setup? Reading the miss tech. So aggressive, both of these guys. <laughs> I'd like to see one of them. I feel like if one of them slows down a bit, starts chilling just a little bit more, they could kind of take control of the match. Yeah. One thing Fox really wants to do in this matchup is just that good jump. Like, win neutral and not lose stage control. Uh huh. Oh. He wanted that spot dodge read. Daybreak does throw out that spot dodge option a lot as um, a panic option. So that was a good move, but didn't quite get it. Good F smash though, cover landing. He's got high recovery there. And you're gonna see a lot of um, Fox bear pressure because almost one bear away, Ooh. probably one bear away now from the right part of the stage. I don't do it, did a good job of uh, turning this around. This is pretty much opposite of what we were seeing the first stock. Mm -hmm. Good F smash, Ooh. he just caught that. Daybreak, leaning back in his seat from that. And that's active five frames, I believe, correct? Active enough. I don't know what the frame data, but yeah, it stays out long enough to where it's super easy to catch like a, a neutral get up. Mm -hmm. And I'm sure Daybreak knows that, and that's why he's like, "Uh, that should not have worked, mm -hmm. or should not have. I should not have done a neutral get up into it." What happens if you attack it? If you space you, the attack right, you can. So you know how you have invincibility frames in your get up attack? Yeah. You can time those to go through the forward smash and then punish it. So yeah, you can totally do that. That's interesting. But I think on most characters, Fox's forward smash will also hit them off the ledge. So just sitting there and waiting may not be a safe option. And Waddle's um, aggro side feels like is putting a lot of pressure on Daybreak, and Daybreak is kind of just like being a little bit evasive right now. But he's not able to put up an offensive front quite yet. Yeah, he's just kind of singing shield. He's not really sure because I don't think he's used to this kind of aggro fox as much. Yeah. He plays a more patient fox himself. Waddle's looking like definitely the most aggressive fox in our state. Mm -hmm. Ooh. He wanted That close. was a nice fair. Had another, had another opportunity, but dropped it. And good down smash. Laser. Down smash, pretty fast option. Decent out of shield, too. Waddle did a good job of uh, angling his up B to stay away from the forward air range. Mm -hmm. And that bear's going to take it. Bought off to another lead. Oh, that shield pressure, though. <laughs> Fox not having almost, the biggest shield. Almost broke it. Mm -hmm. Not yet. Ooh. I think that was a raw up here. He was looking for something a little bit more off that. but and You can DI Falco's throws to evade those lasers. Mm -hmm. And sometimes that will help the Falco follow up off of it. But sometimes it can save you. Mm -hmm. Like when he back throws, his back throw won't ever kill by itself. But sometimes, you have to hit with the laser. sometimes the laser will hit and kill you. So if you DI like downwards. Yeah, that's why I hear he's down is the way yeah, to go. It, the laser won't hit you. It just puts you in a bad spot for recovering, which is better than instantly dying. But and you just you got to know when to do it and when not to. Mm -hmm. And Daybreak is making it a nice comeback here. Just racking up damage and then but up tilt pressure. Both, player, or both characters have such good up tilts. Great out of shield for options. Sure. Great at um, starting combos. Especially Foxes. Holy cow. That was a good up smash. Both players could be in trouble. Up smash Ooh, is going to take it. Waddle closes out. 2-0 over Daybreak. And that was just an interesting clash of styles, I think, too, yeah. overall. Yeah, it was a very fast-paced match. But uh, I think we're up next. Yep. So, all right.